Welcome to the ETX Capital Market Bite. A mixed overnight session for stocks as the US finished the session in slight negative territory due to comments from Fed Chairwoman Janet Yellen and the decline in energy shares which couldn't be halted by a rebound in the financial sector. Asian shares finished the session in slightly positive territory after a bailout plan was agreed by Greece and its creditors, bringing short-term debt relief to the market. The Dow Jones Industrial Average closed three points lower at 18050 and the S&P 500 dropped one point to close at 2107. Commodity currencies are in focus after the Royal Bank of Canada cut interest rates to 0.5% from 0.75%. The Canadian dollar was trading at $1 spot 2936, briefly touching 1 spot 2958, which is its lowest level in six years. The New Zealand dollar slid to 0 spot 6498, around six year lows against Greenback. And the dollar traded at 123 spot 85 yen and in reach of a near three week high of 123 spot 97. The euro dropped slightly against the dollar to 1 spot 0922 pounds. After the historic Iran nuclear deal, US crude rose just under 1% to $51.79 a barrel after collapsing 3% on Wednesday as expectations that increased output from Iran will further add to the oversupply that has seen the slump in the oil market over the last year. Brent gained 0.4% to $57.42 a barrel. Within the equity space, Rio Tinto said on Thursday, posted a sharp rise in second quarter iron ore output from a year ago as a battle to maintain its top market position in China, even as selling prices deteriorate and bad weather continue. The stock opened 0.5% lower at 2,580 pence per share. Data today out of the Eurozone, we have CPI at 10 a.m., US jobless claims at half one this afternoon. The FTSE was seen opening five points lower at 6,702, and the DAX was up 80 points at 11629. Thanks for watching.